Hey, this is Kiki Ayers with the Red Carpet Report. Right now we're in Hollywood at the fourth annual Norma Jean Gala supporting Holly Grove. Hi, how are you? Uh, good, how are you? Thanks. Good. So what brings you out to this event tonight? Uh, well, I think Holly Grove is like such a great cause. You know, there's so many uh, disadvantaged kids in the city and, you know, so many abused kids and from foster homes and Holly Grove fills in such a great uh, service for those kids, you know, through... Um, through the school they run that it's pretty great it's just great to be here and to support them do you know any kids personally that have been through Hollywood uh yeah well besides the famous one the, right. the Norma Jean <laughs> one you know. uh yeah just through like the volunteer work down there you get to you know you get to know a few of them haven't followed all of them all the way through yet but I'm sure I will from um you know what the from the ex the volunteer work and you know, I just think it's like great what they get them to do with the Endless Summer program, which, you know, makes sure, you know, kids have this uh, care. And then just uh, repatching the families up, I think. You know, they're whatever it takes uh, um, slogan. I think that's fantastic what they do there. If any of them wanted to, like, intern for you on set, would you be open to that? Yeah, look, always, you know. I mean, the only problem with me is I always make films overseas at the moment, but if I do something in LA, I'd love to have some of the kids down. Maybe a commercial or something might come up. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, yeah. So you do so many amazing films. Um, what is it about, what do you look for in a script when you decide to take on the film or the job as a director? I think, I, I think you've got to be with the film uh, so long. I think you have to feel that you have to go back to the well of that idea every day. Sometimes it's two years, sometimes it's five years. So you, you better make sure you really like what the, the germ of the project is. And so that's what I look for first, something that really like inspires me to like keep going back. And then, uh, you know, just, working with people actually to tell you the truth I mean you meet so many amazing people working on films that and it's such a collaborative effort working on a film that I just love that part of it that's the that's that's the other thing that sort of gets me out of bed every day any upcoming projects you could tell well, you currently work on? Uh, well I just got a, I've got a couple of things coming out actually I've got a fi uh, film coming out at the end of May called Survivor this has Pierce Brosnan and Mila Djokovic in it and Angela Bassett and uh, Dylan McDermott and then I also have a TV series that I was one of uh, four directors on that was shot all over the world. And that comes out June 5th on uh, Netflix. That's called Sense8. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, so a couple of things right close to one another. Right. And then I've got other things I'm working on at the moment. But nothing at the uh, casting stage at the moment. But soon, hopefully. We're going to need vacation soon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, spent, uh, yeah. I just spent a long time away. So it's good to be back in L.A. with the family for a bit. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you so much for talking to oh. us. We greatly appreciate it. Yeah, nice to nice to meet you. Okay. What do you think about like the anonymous movement using the Guy Fox mask as sort of their rally? Well, I, I think whenever you make a film, you know, you uh, sometimes hope you'll have some cultural impact, and that uh, mask, you know, has just lived on. Whether it's like the people in Egypt, or it was anonymous, or you know, the Scientologist guys, you know, uh, I think it's great. You know, I think anything you can do to uh, poke at the fabric of uh, politic and society, I mean, I think they've they got what the message of the film was, which is not out and out anarchy, but close to, you know. Yeah. <laughs> nice to speak you. to you. Okay. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment with your favorite charity.